but I decided to go one more higher and then the roof line will start right there coming over the edge. What am I doing? Where's my knee? So that way these windows will be also very large and I'm not certain, oh gosh, lag there. Not certain of how I'm going to set up the windows yet. Getting lots of lag actually, I don't know why. I mean, tons of it. This is kind of annoying. But each room should have at least one window. You know what I mean? And it should be a good-sized window. That way you can look around and see everything. Even the giant chicken and the grudge wall that we have going there. Boom! Okay, so there's... Whoops, whoa, I keep going down my makeshift stairs here. There we have it so far. i got to figure out how to make the windows look good. Now, this is an, this is an odd numbered... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Most likely, and probably... Yeah, I'll try to do this. Let's see how this looks from outside and then I'll decide to, if I'm going to keep it or not. Here's what we got so far. Now we're going to see if we're going to have enough dark oak or if I'm going to have to make a trip somewhere, anywhere to find some. Shoot. No! Alright, I'll be back for you, buddy. I hate when I don't have enough materials. I've also made the top floor actually is not as tall as the lower floor. So hopefully, usually when I build these things, they look super top heavy and I'm hoping that will not be the case. Okay. This is probably going to have to be a little taller. And I'm trying to figure dormers out. What am I going to do? Dormers. We've run into a slight problem. Uh, I don't think we're going to have enough dark oak to actually finish this. So, I'm trying to come up with a solution. I was thinking of alternating dark oak and spruce, putting in dormers with spruce siding. Ah, go one more. These aren't permanent, these are just ways to get up. Or something to that effect. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure. Not sure what to do. I've I've got a couple. I found I managed to find a couple of dark oak uh, saplings over in over there in Scotty's wood place. But at the same time, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. This thing is huge. This I'm not like I told you. Like I said, guys, I'm not used to building this big, and so. Mm, not turning out as well as I wanted. I prefer smaller buildings. Oh, okay. We should have plenty of this though. Whoops. Maybe I should have gone for oak for the roof. I've got two sets of dark oak growing and one of them grew and I got quite a few saplings using my fortune pick. This dirt is marking the windows below. I'm going to try to figure out if I'm going to put windows and dormers up here. If so, I had started by growing spruce and dark oak because I wasn't sure how far anything would get. Um, so I should have plenty of spruce and if I do dormers or windows or anything like that then I will make sure that they have spruce on the edges to kind of match down below. Oh shoot. I'm trying to... Mm. What do y'all think? Should I add... Uh, Shutters on the windows down there? They're a little... I don't think I will. Not the ground floor windows because they're going to be too large. But maybe the second floor windows. So I'm going to pretty much set up the entire roof just like this. Ba-boom. And then I'm going to see about trying to... Um, we're going to leave a hole here, I think. Just to let me come and go. 
Uh, then I'm going to see about if I can put some windows up here as well. It's probably, probably going to need them. Man, what a view. What a view. I'm hoping. Oh, yes, the trees are going to block this building mostly from DJ's house, so he won't have to look at this if he doesn't want to. Hooray. Wow. This is a big building. As you can see, I've added another floor up here. Uh, we're going to, real quick, increase the size of this chimney simply because it really needs to be taller than the height than it needs to be taller than the roof and I think that will be plenty done. and then there's definitely gonna have to be more to this roof than just this so I'm probably gonna have to, to try to figure out how to make the roof how to break this roof up a bit because gosh darn it's hot it's high Ooh, I don't know if I'll be able to get up into it even. We'll probably have to set up a ladder, something like that. Um, shoot. I'm letting you guys be here for the very end here as we finish putting the roof on, putting the roof together. I can still get down the regular way, so I'm not worried about leaving a hole or anything like that. Yeah, let's just do a corner. Got enough? 12, 13, maybe not. Oops. Heck of a view! I've only said that like 20 times. Yeah, we have enough of these. We'll probably have to put, and we'll have to put a half slab or something in the center. There we go. Uh, well, let's make some half slabs then. Oh my goodness. I haven't even started on the interior yet. Good grief. All right, nothing can spawn up here. The chimney is really tall. I don't know if I like that or not. We might have to meddle with that. And I'm going to have to try to figure out what I'm going to want what the exterior to look like. All right, I think I figured this out. Here's what we're going for on each, on at least three sides. Hoping that that will look okay. Both like as you guys are looking at it and from the overviewer because I do too many things sometimes it feels like whoops that they look great I mean my house my house looks pretty good but on the overviewer it looks awful terrible like complete poop I hate when that happens we need spruce oh we gotta remove you and then it's a simple matter of poop And these guys, and then the roof. No glass yet. I'm going to have to go get glass, I'm afraid. And if we put it any closer, I guess we could have spread them out and put them out one more. Uh-oh, that might require complete changing. No, then they're going to be too close to the edges. I think right now they look actually kind of like, they look right. They'll be like sticking out. Nope, 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 nope. We got it right. Ouch. Got to quit second guessing myself. Every once in a while, I do get it right. Whoa. All right. Spruce. Do, do, do. Let me finish these up. Or at least try to. I'm running out of time. We might have to finish. I might have to finish the next day, but you guys won't know. It'll just be a few moments. All right. All the gabled windows are in. We're going to take a look at this guy from the outside. Well, we're going to make it day first. Can I get... There we go. I move? No. Still down here. Right here. <sighs> Jumped in the bed. We're going to take a quick look around and see how this looks before we move on. This is probably the end of episode two of this. We're not finished yet, folks. Obviously. Whew. Where am I going to be able to get a good look at this thing? Uh, hmm. I guess we'll go over here again. We go over by the chicken. The trees are blocking off any real good view. See, I'm going to put rooms upstairs. They're going to be full of beds. That's why I'm going to have to keep... 
gonna grab some more wool here in a moment. Let's go over this way. Ooh. That didn't that's not one of mine. These are the two I've been growing, and I'll have to chop them down eventually. Let's see if I can see this thing from over here. Gotta keep an eye out. There are mobs spawn all over the place that spawn. Chicken's in the way. Let's go this way. Oh, yeah. I, made it. I like it. That looks pretty nice. Now, I was thinking about adding something to um, to that center tiny room at the top, but I'm doubting I will. I, uh, I'm liking that a lot. I am pleased. Pleased with my design, which turned out better than I thought. Especially considering I was making it up as I go along. Yeah. Yeah, it's not too shabby. Uh, there'll be individual rooms on the second floor. We'll get working on that next episode, I think. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, to be continued.